Hi, uh, today we are going to discuss possible interpretations for themes, for dream themes by taking into consideration psychological, cultural, and common sense interpretations. Uh, first of all, the first dream theme is falling, which indicates nervous. Uh, psychologically, we think that a person is nervous when it dreams of being fallen in his dream. Um, from the from Chinese culture, we believe that uh, when we fall in a dream, we might be nervous. And uh, from the perspective of common sense interpretations, when we fall, we feel nervous. So the next one is a dream about being killed. So we relate things to stressful situations that a person encounters. So I um, like consider that person or uh, we having a GQ situation inside the brain is because that person has a stressful 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 situations in his daily life, like problems with people, things, and anything that puts stress on himself. So the next one is about the common sense interpretation of culture. So about the culture, I think this doesn't related to culture, right? But anyhow, if we feel like stressful, but we feel like stressful, and then I think it's similar to the cue because we can when we can cope with that stressful situation, and then we just like wonder to uh, going to die. Okay, now the third most common dream theme is swimming. Now in a cultural and common point of view, uh, actually you have none. Because you cannot say that common sense people dream of swimming because they want to swim. It just doesn't really make some sense in it. While cultural, there's no culture that uh, related to swimming. So <clears throat> the only interpretation, interpretation that can be done is the psychological interpretation where we believe that swimming signifies someone that wants to be free because swimming is a relaxing sport so we believe that if someone dreams of swimming or uh, possibly flying it's someone's desire to be free and to be relaxed and not being shackled down by anything it's like the opposite of being cute and uh, stressful situations the next dream theme is fire which indicates uh, the sense of danger uh, in one's mind, uh, from the perspective of Chinese culture, we believe that fire is a sense of danger and a sense of destruction because fire can burn out anything that is that has life. Yes, you are right. And then we carry on to being an animal. Sometimes animals like a bird can also link to uh, the person with desire to desire for freedom as the bird can fly on the sky and that is constant of freedom for a person to be born. or maybe that person just wants to like get away from the society human society and desire to be not shackled down by society's norms and virtues and just follow their own instincts that's why they dream of being an animal okay uh, next <coughs> would be a dream team of finding money so we believe that people who dream of finding money desires money. This could be because of uh, maybe they just want more money, <laughs> like they love having money, or this could be because that they are poor, they are stressed because of impoverished life, and that leads to the dreaming of uh, money. Okay, seeing a UFO is also one of the dream themes, where from. Uh, the perspective of common sense interpretations. Uh, People are curious and wondering about questions of ET and the aliens from outer space. Maybe this uh, curiosity inside the humans 
let them to be my maybe they want to train and but seeing a real easy or doing so carry on to the our eight green beans which is a pet so somehow a pet is a disgust which also similar to the fire which also like a, a sense of anger to all of the people and I think Earthquake is a natural disaster that maybe can make most of the people fear of. Yeah, I believe that Earthquake is a dream that a premonition of danger in the future. Like the dreamer subconsciously know that the future is going to be a uh, terrible one. So his dreams of Earthquake Psychologically, culturally, it does not relate to it, so that's logically because you don't just dream of earthquakes that's gonna happen in the future. <laughs> Somehow, dreams does not happen. The second last dream team would be seeing an angel where one has positive vibes because angel indicates uh positive vibes <laughs> and <clears throat> from psychological view when one see an angel you will be blessed ah uh, uh, will be blessed and will think more positively compared to the former one and our last one is encountering god so somehow people uh, i'm thinking to the situations of stressful who is being killed from drinking and somehow people who is in stressful situations they want to seek advice and mostly they think of God is the highest or maybe the greatest person to seek the advice from then I think we shall end our experience okay.